4218, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Tommy Love, guest mm-hmm. of the show, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? And Upstate Predators for winning 42 to 18 against the Charlotte Colonials. Colonials. I don't even know if. I don't even know if it's Char. It might be Charlotte or Charlotte. I don't know. Ain't gotta be, uh, <laughs> gotta be Charlotte. Yeah. But they got they got, got scraped, so that's all that matters. You all know right. what I'm saying? That's Scrape. that. That's that fam luck. You heard? <laughs> but fact yeah, there. um, factor, factor, factor. It, it's a big show. It's a big show because it's the finals. Finals. The finals. Finals. What you already know, man. Welcome to the podcast that brings you raw and original takes on a wide range of sports and entertainment. It's your boy Henny Drake. It's John John. And this is the, the fan, fan perspective. perspective. And we ain't got all the facts. Nope. But we are gonna keep it 100 with all the opinions that we do give. One zero zero out of zero one thousand. <laughs> you already know, man. Paka, 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 paka. Episode one, two, eight. You know what I'm saying? Catch us on Facebook. Catch us on um, Instagram. Instagram fan podcast. That's with a PH if you listening in. Yep, yep. Twitter. Well, if you listening in, you probably already know what's the PH. But, mm-hmm, <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. but uh, you know, uh, Spotify, all that good stuff. Anchor. You know what I'm saying? But um, we got to get sure, to this for final. Sure, for sure. Need some tissue? You all right? Nah, I'm straight. I'm straight. How you, how you dealt straight. with it, man? You know what I'm saying? What's up? How you dealt with it? How you felt that your watching. boys went out, man? I was watching on Gamecast, you know what I'm saying? I was I was mad because I was telling you, Jim Butler ain't that hurt. <laughs> he always do this. But, you know what I'm saying? Before we get into all that, you want to just say that we was uh we was close on that one. We both lost that one, but we was close we went seven. You know, yeah. we both predict. Well, I predict at least I don't I'm not you said sure. Dallas though. You said, yeah, I know. I'm, 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 talking, about, I'm talking about the most most competitive series. The most yeah, competitive yeah, yeah. I think the we both said that. Yeah, we yeah. both said that. And then yeah, I, I did say Dallas just because you know yeah, I yeah. want to be different. You had to mix it. Yeah, but you, sure. you got it right, spot on. I think right. Yeah, yeah. I said five. Sure. Golden State in five. I said the Heat. I said the Heat in seven. But you know, I went to the Boston. Yeah, man. Them two games, man. Them six games. The eight point six. Point game, but not only that. I mean, you, I could Jimmy Butler's whole performance throughout the playoffs can help me forgive him a little bit for that six point game. Even though he always, I seem like he always do this. Whether he was with Philly, whether he was with Chicago, he always ball out, and then he have a little mediocre games and all that, mm-hmm. and then he ball out again. You know what I'm saying? But just his whole performance make me forgive him real quick. But what I can't forget. What I cannot forgive, man. Hold up. Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry. Championship blood. I seen you hold the trophy in the parade. Kyle Lowry. I had pictures of you holding the trophy. When everybody talking about Kawhi, no, you had that trophy in your hands. Uh, I saw Drake with it, yeah. Yo, listen. (laughs) Listen. How... In two games, Kyle both not nah, because the other white boy behind him ain't getting off the hook either. I just forgot Max Struess or whatever his name is, or, or I forgot what his Kyle name. Is. How both point guards go one for twenty eight in two games, Kyle Those are the two defining games too, to be honest. Because them niggas, those like are the said, games that Jimmy Butler would, he that was they were supposed they, to pick him up. They couldn't they couldn't shoot a ball in Niagara Falls, bro. No, like we had like twelve points in the first quarter. So yeah, they, <laughs> yo. But that's what I'm saying. Y'all still took it to seven. That's the crazy shit. Because you know we wasn't supposed to do that, man. It's a hero, hero. Aslan was supposed to punch somebody in the face, hero. wake him up or something. Heroes <laughs> That's hurt. all he was there for? Nah, Draymond, Draymond woke up for that game, that game six, though. They did, but they should have been up. But yeah, yeah, yeah y'all, prob- y'all problem was, and the series was, it was like the first quarters was just crazy. Like, a team would be up 15 in the first quarter, like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all games was back and forth. Like people, like home court advantage didn't matter. Like, like the whole playoff. Yeah, you know, until like the, what the last two couple games of the series that was actually the right. You know, and and you know what? Everybody talking shit about Jimmy Butler too. I know that ain't his game. I know, but I, when I seen the highlight and I seen what he did, mm-hmm. I can understand it. That's the game today. Like you know, what I'm saying that's how right. the game. That's, that's, that's what, everybody right. in Temple. He felt good, so he shot right. it. That's, yeah, that's that's what I was gonna ask you. You know what I mean? Because when I said it, I even, you know what I mean? Like I said, check it out, fam. Twitter, fan podcast on Twitter. But I was like, he should have drove. He should have, maybe. He should have drove. But when I said that to myself, 
You know how many I'm times not mad at it though. You know, saying, you know how many times Horford blocked somebody on that exact play this whole playoffs? Right. He's been consistent with that. He knew right. it was coming. Right, right. Actually, that's I, I, that's I, why he was so far back, because he figured he was gonna do it too. Right. Like I said, I wasn't mad at it, but I if my, you would my first, a couple more steps in, it would have been a little my, my first, like I said, my first was like, you gotta drive. Because even if you miss it, maybe you get the foul. Like, that's too late, like to like, you know what I'm saying? Like the refs gonna call us up, man. If you get a little contact down there, nah, you would think. Know. Nah, you would think No but at the same time got, though, that's, it slide But yeah, yeah No but I'm saying But at the same time Jimmy that's Jimmy game too He give you that little Higher layup When he gonna give mm. you that left To push off you And you know Make the layup But maybe you draw a foul But like you said Today's game that You know what else though up. You know what else though They pulling up You know what else though That was against us Scott Foster No Scott Foster Yo, did you know Boston is 12 and 0 When Scott Foster is Reffing their games Now the we playoffs? know Now we know Now we know <laughs> Now we know Oh yeah Hopefully he uh <laughs> Maybe he's uh, in, the, in the finals. Who knows? I don't know. They gotta do an investigation on that. <laughs> yeah, man, he might got. Cause you know he's gonna get Draymond the tech. Listen, right, Draymond <laughs> getting the tech. Uh, right, Draymond getting the tech. He already got like a thousand, so he gonna he might yeah. be suspended the game. That's what I'm saying, right? Time. And give him a tech or something like They're that. Gonna be a repeat of the finals with Brown and those. Right, give him flagrant two or something. Right, be out. You know what I'm saying for the rest of the game. Or something like that You know what I mean Like I said with his fan Doing all the other stuff You know they Gambling on the stuff So shit matters how, but, do you, uh, how do you feel About this final matchup man do you, I, how, how close do you think it is Because I think It's super close I know uh, It's tough though It's tough though Because as close as it is It is a major factor No right and Like I said When we were doing our predictions On the uh, You know Eastern and Western Conference final I was like that was your. That yeah, was your. I was like, I'd rather see, you know what I'm saying? But I was like, the Heat gonna take it. But yeah, nah, I like, I, it's more exciting. I think the matchups, player by player, it, everybody great. match up. Match everybody up player. matches up. That's what I'm saying. Like, player by player, like, it matches up beautifully. Because Boston don't got a super big. I mean, sometimes they do, but it's really out hard for Yeah. They got offered in uh, 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 the Williams. Williams. Yeah. yeah. And Williams, and Robert Williams, but. He be, he was like a no factor in y'all y'all series because y'all don't really got no big man. He's a Bam, you know what I'm saying. Bam was like the only big man on y'all team, you know what I'm saying. And um, yeah, but like I said, Grant Williams, you know what I mean. He hard. He come off the bench. He got, he good to match up with Draymond. You know what I mean. You got like I said, it's 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 gonna be fireworks. It's gonna be a lot of high scoring games and man and whoever you know have a bad game. That's what that's the other team is gonna win, man. That's what I think of that moment. What the, the the main major factor is experience. That ain't no. I don't think so. You crazy? Six out of eight so. finals. No, listen, listen. They listen, know listen. where they at. <laughs> no, Steph no, no, Curry no, no. is twenty one no. and four in series. No, listen, listen. Like, I, I, like look, look, look. I understand their pedigree. They're champions. All right, let's get this. They got like seven players. Maybe not. I'm I'm, I'm saying seven is too many, but they got five players that was in their championship. Team three years ago, you know what I'm saying? That's Draymond, that's uh, uh Looney. They got the staff, they got the three Clay. players that was in the first championship, right? That's all that matters. No, 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 don't get it, yeah, don't get it twisted. <laughs> but remember, the last time they won it was what they, they won one, it was what um, with KD, with KD, yeah. Mm-hmm. And that's then a whole bunch of injuries, like you be pointing out, man, whole bunch of injuries. Right, that's what I'm saying. So KD, and then like I said, they get, they lost to Toronto, but then like not like Clay, Clay is like you know he's banged up. You know what I'm saying? He's at seventy percent. Uh, he's still a sniper. No, he is, he is, but he's like the third or fourth option. That's why I put out there as well. Mm-hmm. But um, you gotta listen, you gotta think though, right? You got that. I understand that they got they got championships, they got the pedigree. People try to say that, but Boston, come on, bro. They they Boston on, been there though. They on their Warriors run right now. I'm, what I'm saying is they've been there though. Not this team. Not to the finals, but they've been there. You gotta think. The first year Tane and Ricky season, remember? Against LeBron and them. Mm-hmm. They made it all the way to the Eastern Conference Finals that Ricky year. Mm-hmm. Tatum. That's what I'm saying. They on their Warriors run. Smart. Jalen Brown. They was there. Like they witnessed mm-hmm. that. Then they went through the whole Kyrie thing in the playoffs, battling LeBron and last year. Same thing. So they got three or four years under their belt and experience in the playoffs. Then you bring the veteran, Al Horford, that he ran into the goddamn the buzz saw too with LeBron James in the Atlanta Hawk days. With 147 Joe Johnson one game. That. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? With Joe Johnson and all them. Shout out to Joe Johnson. The Boston wins. 
He was on the roster long enough. I seen that. Like, yeah, he, he was, was on the roster long year? enough. Yeah, yeah, he was lo- there long enough to the, get a ring. The highlight I seen of him in the Boston jersey, all them players that was on the court with him do not look like they play. <laughs> right, right. Nah. <laughs> like, like, that's when they was all hurt. Yeah. That's what I'm like, what? Remember in the middle part of the season, like, everybody would get a 10 day contract? Like, everybody would get a 10 day contract. And, you know, he, he can chance to get a ring. But um, you got White. 10 days, man. Give me a 10 day contract. Right, right. You got the, uh, what's the backup point guard? White. He came from. The Spurs, you know what I'm saying? Popovich is making the playoffs. So it's a couple, you know, they got experience. So I don't think when people talk about uh, pedigree, like they've been there. They've been in them tough games, you know what I mean, to 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 withstand like you none know, of the jitters from being in a big moment, you know what I mean? I respect so, it. I respect it, but it's still levels to this shit. No, it is. It's still levels. But like I said, the levels. One, Draymond, Draymond is one somebody that sets the tone crazy. Like six out of eight again. You know what I'm saying? So he's been there. This is nah, six res- time. Respectfully. So yeah, he yeah. he know how to get a game grooving. He know how to because a lot of what basketball is, what I'm you know what I've learned because I don't play basketball obviously, but what I watch and what I listen to people, a lot of basketball is is um uh, uh, the flow, the flow of the game. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. Just your passes got up. That's why assists is so. And that's another thing with that Heat game. I was looking at the assists. He ain't winning shit with 14 assists. <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> not at all. Not sad. It, but you got to blame the assists with the not making shots either. Yeah, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I'm mean, just like 0 for 30 when they scored you know, like it's, nine it's points full, in the first quarter. It's a full circle. Yeah, you know it, it was crazy. Yeah. But, um, man, I think one of the X factors, though, for the Warriors, man, is a lot of people ain't saying it yet. Andrew Wiggins, man, he's the one matchup that's like, hold up, because you, because the thing is, I look at, because what you said, what you said, I basically made a Facebook post saying the same thing. Like it's so tough for me because you got, you got, yes, you got the 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 um the greatness of Steph, you got the greatness of Clay, you got the uh, in Game Six in particular, you know what I'm saying? You got uh, Draymond, got just. The whole his aura his is going to impact the game itself, um, but then you got Tatum and Brown and Smart that's been locking everybody up this whole postseason, and it's like Smart is the only one. He's the shortest one, and you'd be like, "Oh, he ain't nothing," but he's the defensive player of the year. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? People, then it's, people forget Tatum, that. Tatum is. Probably, I mean, he be on and off sometimes on offense, but you know he could drop fifty on you, and he we all seen him lock people up, like, and he's tall, he's six eight. Then you got Jalen Brown, who's six six, I guess, but he looked just as tall as Jason Tatum, and he looked stronger than Jason Tatum, and he known for his explosiveness and locking people up. But it's like, can you really lock up Curry? Who, who can lock up? Curry? <laughs> you feel me though? That's what you I'm saying. Like, so like you, it's like it really even you, defensive player of the year. No, it, nah, you only you only you only can contain him, man. That's it. A little man. bit. A little because bit. Because all this containing that they talk about, he ain't got no final championship. He still have the 26 in his career and it's a, in, five, in six finals. No, nah, no, nah, that's what I'm saying. Like, he ain't bullshit. It's it's, it's, <laughs> certain, it's certain players that you, it's like, all right, we we know Curry gonna get hit. Now let's focus on Clay. Let's focus on. And then, uh, and then our whole, our whole for it is pool. Dominican. So it's like, he's Spanish. So it's like, come on, man. I want the Spanish guy to win too, bro. Right. No, that's what I'm saying. I but. want him to win. <laughs> I want him to win. Like I said, all them years in Atlanta, man, and grinding, like I said, running to the bus all, which is LeBron James, not winning it. Um, like I said, you only can, you only can slow them down, man. It's, it's going to be a tough series. Like I said, I like Grant. Look, Grant Williams is, is a baby, what? Baby Draymond. Like, he physical. Little, yeah. He physical. You know what I'm saying? He get in your face a little bit, and guess what? He just spot up three ass nigga. Like, that's all he really got. Uh, Look, that's Draymond. You, you heard what Draymond told Shaq, Draymond right? the same shit. What? What he says? Hey, I know they was talking shit. No, uh, no, nah, Charles Barkley. Charles Barkley. No, Chuck. Chuck been here. Chuck yeah, been here. Charles Barkley. They had him on the interview. You know, Draymond was in the pregame, yeah. just, like doing his pregame, like his his shooting his layup, shooting the shots and all that while he's doing the interview. With I, know, I know Chuck. <laughs> Chuck don't give a shit. I thought it was dope though. And Chuck was like, yeah, "Yo, yeah. man, why you why you shooting threes in practice? We ain't gonna shoot them in the game." He was yeah, like, yeah, I heard that part. Yeah, <laughs> you ain't gonna make them with him. He was like, "I make them when it count." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I heard that part. Yeah. <laughs> And he do like a motherfucker too. Yeah, yeah. Because even nah. that finals against LeBron, boy, he, Draymond was could have been the finals MVP. Man, yeah, a couple people could have. He was. MVP, he, you know then he dropped like in the clinching game, like thirty eight, a thirty eight point triple double or something. Who? Draymond. I don't know. Draymond was balling, y'all. 
Yeah, like I said, Draymond straight. Like he 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 the glue to that team though. He don't he know how to show up. Yeah, like he the glue. He the muscle. Like he the everything. Like you know what I'm saying. He set the tone, like you said. And I like his show. I like his show. Yeah, he like being he, raw with it. Right, right. That's that, that's his game though yeah, too. You know what I'm saying? It. Like he know. It's like with Chuck. He know I'm gonna hit him when it count. I could be old for forty, but this clutch one on the corner. I'm going to hit this bitch and I'm going to talk big shit because what? Guess what? Because you don't know nothing about that, Chuck. I right. got three rings. Exactly. <laughs> got three rings. <coughs> I got like 12 rebounds out there, like six assists, and two steals. and I might got only seven points, but goddamn, this one three that I just hit clinched the game, you know what I'm saying? For sure. But yeah, like I said, just, just all around, the matchup is just beautiful. Like you said, Wiggins. I think Wiggins will, will guard Tatum, right? <laughs> yep. Uh, uh, Brown, it makes sense. Brown gonna, you know, Brown gonna get Clay. You know what I'm saying? He gonna get Clay. You know, Smart gonna get, you know, Curry. Obviously, um, like I said, they gonna boss now. Gonna, Jordan Poole. Who got Jordan Poole? Well, he coming off the bench. But, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Nah, he he's he the six man. Who they um? <clears throat> well, yeah, he was about. To be That's what I'm saying. He the six man. But um, I think they'll they'll run the small ball. And like I said, Grant Williams will come. Kevin Looney. That's what I'm saying. They got uh, the, uh, other Robert Williams. <laughs> They kind of the same style type of game. Mm-hmm. That's what I said. Robert Williams will probably, I mean, Grant Williams will probably start for they could put him on Draymond. You know what I'm saying? And then Al Horford would be Draymond or Looney, whoever he got to face. So, like I said, everywhere it matches this up is perfectly, great finals. bro. It's a great finals. And it matches it's players up. that we love, too. It ain't no player that we yeah. hate in this series. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I you mean, got, some people might hate Draymond, but yeah. I love Draymond. No, that's the only person people might dislike. That's you know what I'm saying. saying. Like, I, I love Draymond. Though. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? You got to think the first, first year head coach. For Boston, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's that's a dope factor too. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's there. Uh, if Boston wins, like they'll t- they'll take over uh, the most rings again. Like, championship, take it back. yeah, take it back from the Lakers. Like, it's a lot of things, man. I'm I'm excited, definitely to to you know to watch it. You know what I mean? Because like, I said, it's exciting. He would have went. I'm still watching it, but it's not exciting as you know this series as it is, man. So definitely, like I said, the young guns coming up. I mean, they're young, but they they've been there since day one. You know I say I mean? this though. <coughs> Excuse me. I say that to say this. I say this though. Yep. Boston ain't scored. Ain't I mean, ain't played against no firepower like this yet. Everybody on the Warriors should score. It ain't just Jimmy Butler. It ain't just Durant or Kyrie. <laughs> But yeah, I understand that. But I think it ain't just Giannis. But I think they I got think, a squad of shooters. Exactly. But look what you. <laughs> but look what you just named, bro. Look at the teams. But that's in, just, individual, no, though. right? But look at the teams. You but that's just, individual. But this those are the four. best teams. If somebody would have said coming in, it would have been like, yeah, Milwaukee. And then, like you said, e- the e- Middleton one. Though. Like you said, right? But I'm saying you got Easy Money and you got Kyrie, which is probably the most skilled player in the league. You had to guard them, regardless. Like I always say, if you got swept. two, that, yeah, if you got two, they was good. They good enough. They like five. Swept them. You know what I'm saying? Um, he took the Greek freak. Come on, man. He's the freak. He's going to be MVP it every still year. It still ain't the world. Just the you know what I'm saying? No, I'm just saying, though, uh, that, excuse me. you know, that just going up, bro, you to face the big dogs, like you saying. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I think they had the hard, the hardest road to mm-hmm. get there. Nah, definitely. And who's gonna scare them? But you know and what? Who's gonna scare them? You know what though? You know what I'm saying though? You know what though? Cause I seen somebody, it must have been a Warriors fan or somebody played for the Warriors or something. Mm-hmm. They was on Twitter talking about, oh, they came in talking about Twitter what fans. we gonna what we gonna do with Jokic. And then it turned into Jokic got no help. And then it's what we gonna do with this person. Who they played in the next round? Uh, what, we, what they gonna do with what, they, Memphis, gonna, what they gonna do with Ja? Memphis, yeah. And then it turned into Ja. They ain't got no help. And then it, you know what I'm saying. So the Warriors kind of been no sleeping like yeah, listen, but they, they've been rolling through though. No, no, they've what been I'm saying, no right. key rolling through. No, they've been rolling Besides through. Besides getting hit by fifty that one game, yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. I think everybody had one of them games this postseason though. Yeah, yeah. But like I said, um, that was just outrageous. Though. Right. <laughs> but at the same time, like I said, like even like. Us, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, definitely check out our, you know, past podcasts. But, you know, when we predicted stuff, we, we had Golden State. You know what I'm saying? By a breeze. That Memphis one was a little harder. It was a little harder. You feel me? It's a little harder to pick, but we, you know, it's still Golden State. Shit. Dallas, you know, you just put Dallas, you know, to, to, like you said, to, to, to make shit fun. But I said five. You know what I mean? Boston on the way up was a little, 
a little harder. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Like a little harder. That's the thing. You know, picking and you, stuff you, like you that. know me. You know how I go about things. I gotta be able to see you like in the winner circle in my head. I gotta be yeah. able to visualize you holding the trophy. With this series, I can visualize both teams. I could visualize Jason Tatum up there with Deuce holding the trophy. You know what I'm saying? With the this for you, Kobe. You know what I'm saying? But then I can see mm-hmm. Steph Curry like, yeah, you see four of them things. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I got two without Durant. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I got a unanimous MVP. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I got a three point record by far. By far, I'm about like, to double it. Like <laughs> I'm about like, to double it. Every day, like beating that shit. <laughs> well, hopefully, hopefully, King can beat that one day, man. Fuck. That's how. And I got my road dog that's gonna be. And I got my road dog that's gonna talk his shit too. So, <laughs> what you gotta say, Draymond? <laughs> Like I can see, I can see both happening. Cause Steve Curry, you know, all he do is win. All he do is win, 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 no matter what. So, I can see both ways, man. So who you got? Shit, jump rope, please. Hmm. Hold up. I'm about to see the matchup head to head. I gotta see it in front of me. YouTube, Spotify, Anchor, Breaker, Google Podcast. Check that out. Fan podcast on Instagram and IG. That is Instagram and Twitter. You know what I'm saying? That's with the PH. You know what I'm saying? Definitely check us out. Check out the page. Like, subscribe. Cost zero dollars. Go, you know, hit that playlist. You got the balance perspective on there. Go check them videos out. You know what I mean? If you like your little rapping and, you know, freestyling and stuff like that, go definitely check that out. Like I said, man, definitely check out this page for, you know, more content to come. You know what I mean? For sure. But it's the NBA Finals. I can't find a box score. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> I'm going with the Warriors. Going with the Warriors. And how many games, sir? Six. Who's your MVP? Steph Curry. Steph Curry. Yeah, I'm going cliche. Steph Curry. Steph I'm going Curry. cliche as a motherfucker because everybody choose six. Well, <laughs> 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 I'll take you unless you. What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? <laughs> I'm going the other way. I know you was. I know you was. I'm going the other Cause way. Cause I can see it. I know you see it. Any, many, money, mo. I'm going with Boston the seven and Marcus Smart. is gonna win the MVP. Marcus Smart. Marcus Smart. For what? What he gonna just get bad steals? He gonna get. <laughs> he gonna do what Marcus Smart do? You know what I mean? Get his little Shoot backwards three. Get his light little fifteen points. You know what I'm saying? Six rebounds, seven assists, a couple, couple. Man, you know they're mm, giving it to Tatum. Couple major steals. <laughs> Come on, Eagle Dollar won one. So over Curry. So what you mean? So why not Marcus Smart? Jason Defense. Tatum sent a text to Kobe, man. Hey man, hey man. <laughs> All lines up. Defensive Player of the Year. You know what I'm saying? Wins the MVP. You know, makes a couple key key plays. You know what I'm saying? To stop Curry from, you know, making potential three pointers to tie the game or to win the game. If that happened, that's gonna be like how the fuck who the hell was Marcus Smart? Celtics. (laughs) And he just had a monstrous year one year. God damn, he won the defense player of the year and the finals MVP. He only six three. (laughs) It happens. It can happen, baby, and that's gonna happen. That'd be fire though. That'd be fire. I I love you know I love different stuff, man. I love the That's what I see, man. The, you know, it's crazy though to put it in perspective, Fan fans' perspective. To uh, they went like six out of eight, and LeBron went That's eight right. in a row yeah, LeBron, with two different teams. LeBron was fucking king. <laughs> he was fucking king, man. <laughs> like, that nigga went to like what, like twelve and like something like. like he went ten, to ten. He went to like ten, like he ten, to 12, he 12, four, 12 years. Right? He four and six. Ten, twelve years. Or something, yeah. Man. Come on, man. King shit. Look, we still talking about the king. Goddamn finals. God damn it. Everybody's still talking about the king. They just yeah. talking mad shit about the king. I'll be like, why is y'all talking that's about the, him if y'all just go talking shit? That's the most disrespectful. You not even doing nothing. That's the most disrespect the king I know, man. For sure. <laughs> yeah. Other than the president, but that's nah, the it's president. A lot, it's a lot of disrespect to kings in history. No, history, you, yeah. No, no. When I, you learn about it, no, they no, said no. the kings was really good people. No, 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 no. That's what I said. That's what I was telling you. You know, I, you know, could we name my son, my son king. I was like, yeah, you're going to be a good king because all these other kings, man, they ain't shit. Man. Mm-hmm. They slaying villages and doing all kind of shit. That's, the, that's, that's, the, how they that's the cruel it. backstory of right. the king. Yeah, exactly. So, But, um, but yeah, 
But like I said, uh, <laughs> NBA Finals, man. NBA Finals, man. man but it's an exciting you, time of the year, man. For sure, for sure. But I say, I like, I like th- this is just that time of the year where I say I like, I like watching basketball. Sponsorship. You know what I'm saying? This, yeah, this yeah. is why this, it's exciting. Nah, going you know, back you, and forth. I see you tomorrow then. I'm going right. to see you tomorrow then. You know what I'm saying? We'll be back. Like you said, right? You got a chance that, to punch back. And right. That's what, I, that's what I like. And that's why mm-hmm. I said if. You know, going back to LeBron, if you would have got in, you yeah. know what I mean? You got to see the same team back to back. But did you peep this stat? The lowest the lowest viewed NFL game last year? NFL? Uh-huh. Yeah. Was higher than the highest viewed NBA game? Come on, man. You know NFL. NFL the single game watched 5.7. That was the lowest. 5.7 million people. You know, the Texans and... Probably Texans and Browns or something. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 but, uh, um, the, the NBA highest view game was 5.4 million. Listen, man, never fucking lack it, man. You know how it goes, <laughs> Yo, bro. They you know go how on it shit, goes, boy. man. Come on, man. You know I mean? And like I said, that's that's they invest into it. Yeah, they invest into it. And plus, it's not in your face every fucking day. You feel me? It's not mm-hmm. in your face every nah, day. I do be sometimes. Pause, but um, they. It's three times a week. They trying to get it more. I'm about but to say they they about to take over Christmas, right? Right, Christmas. <laughs> like, Christmas. The NBA is no, like but, what? No, NBA but, is like how you gonna shit on but, us like that? Right. So, but even if listen, even if the NFL was every day, it's only gonna be what they're gonna one, force people to get one, more TV. One two games, you know what I'm saying? Like the NBA, yeah. you can go to NBA ticket, and if MLB ticket, and you watch, you got ten games or fifteen games to watch. How many Thursday night games that you if you was bored, you watch Texans versus Browns because it was just on TV. And guess what? They it was entertaining too. You'd be like, what the fuck? I didn't think this game was gonna be this entertaining. Are you not entertained? And never fucking lacking, bro. That shit sounded official. <laughs> I don't know how it's gonna sound. That shit in my ears. I don't know it if it's the good. Duce. It's the Duce, I that must say. That shit sound say, like Michael, Michael Buffer Jr. type shit. I must shit. say, I must say, going into boxing. <laughs> going into boxing. Going into boxing. Do that. <laughs> going into boxing, <laughs> man. <laughs> That boy can't secure the bag. Got the bag alert. <laughs> bag alert. Secure the bag. The bag yeah. alert. Bing. That's how that's what Roly was hearing when he got rock. Right, right. Oh, he, <laughs> Bing. he heard that too, right? He heard it. His bank account was nice. Oh, yeah, nice that's why he was hype, man. That's what, he said it in the, the press conference. Payday. Yeah, the biggest payday. <laughs> he said yeah, it in the, yeah. I had to say you beat them, so I'll get this fight. <laughs> You gotta talk shit. You know how it go. You know how it go. I'd say you undefeated. That's probably the they best, both under Floyd. That's probably the best thing he said in his all his trash talk. <laughs> what quote? Just that one. I had to say you won so I can get this fight. Hey man, can do what you gotta do, brother. Secure the bag. They wasn't man. gonna let me get it. Yeah, whatever you gotta do, secure the bag, man. Like I said, they both under Floyd, so you know. <clears throat> a little, little chess play right there as well, you know what I'm saying? Definitely for sure. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, like I said, Tank took him out in six rounds, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Romero did. He did put up a good fight, you know what I'm saying? For them five rounds, you know. What From what I, mean? I seen, yeah, he yeah. was he was at least active. No, that's what I'm saying. Like we, watched, he, like, he was, we watched it. Like, he caught him a couple times. No, that's what I said. It was he, he made good. Move. He was good. I was thinking. I was like, he. I thought he was gonna last longer than that, but you know, with Tank power. And he's the last one. And he got power so too. He got those speed. And he got power too, but that was more speed, I think. That yeah. was just Yeah, he ain't, even, he ain't even hit him with all his mic. That's you know what, what he said. Yeah, yeah. I don't think now, even from the replay and his left head. It is left head though. And, you know what I'm saying? When we we saw it and stuff like that live, like I said it was. So imagine if he hit him, you know what I mean, hard, you know what I mean? And like I said, the dude, you know, Mary was he's a little a little scared of him, but like you said, you got that bag in front of you and and it's boxing, like you can't be afraid of nobody. Else. So, so I, I ain't see old boy fight at all before this Me fight, either. right? I, I seen like a little twenty second highlight with a promo joint. Right, I, right. It was like twenty seconds of Tank, <laughs> twenty seconds of him, yeah. like right before the fight happened. Because I was in here recording some, yeah. and then I I, caught, I fell asleep, so I caught it like three in the morning on YouTube. Right, right. It was twenty one minutes, <laughs> so it was right, like so you was good. Right? You yeah, just, I was just whatever. you saw twenty one. Like all right, cool. 20, yeah, 20, 20. But um. The, what I what I first noticed was like, and it made me think back to the press conference when they uh, I told little bro about this too. When they asked Tank, how 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 is he gonna how is he gonna deal with how are you gonna deal with uh, Roley's uh, awkward style? He's like, I don't think it's awkward. He's like, you ever just like you ever seen somebody first come into the gym 
and they've been in there for like two weeks, and they think they're the man. They think they can fight, but they can't really fight. That's what he looked like. <laughs> <laughs> so when I seen it, and I seen Romero come out like this, yeah. like he throwing like yeah, yeah, all yeah. hooks all day. I was like, yeah, he looked like he just learning how to fight. Like he ain't tucking that chin or nothing. No, that. Yeah, yeah. And and that's what I'm always scared of for Tank. And that's why I was like, I was kind of like, because when they said old boy got power and stuff, I was like, I always say. Tank leave his chin open If somebody got power Catch him It might get ugly Right And it happened the other way Cause old boy left his shit Wide open too No right right No but, I, <laughs> no, but that's what That's what I was saying too though Like I was watching Like you said I noticed it down I'm like <clears throat> Tank got too much power For you to leave But then you know it's Too much skill But then at the same time Like I said You can practice that You know how it goes You can practice that shit All training camp Once you get in there It's different You Mm -hmm. you just You freeze up You freeze up Or you just like Fuck this I'm out So you know At times As I was saying And I'm He I Now he got his guy up Now he good But then like you said Most Like 70% of the time He had his hands down Because he felt he can catch Tank And that shit Hands down Man down man Yo With me man With boxing I think about See if I if I was bad and I'd be bad man in boxing. With me, most of the time in boxing, you could tell who gonna win the fight from the face off. Most of the time, hell yeah, that's what it's like. Like seventy percent of the time, you could see who gonna win the fight. Most of the time, yeah. So when I seen the first face off, when I first heard of the fight, I was like, I don't know, Tank. Tank kind of like he kind of maybe he was playing that little chess game. Like let me, yeah. Cause he, cause one thing I look for is who gonna look first, who gonna, who gonna look away first, or who gonna look down, or who gonna blink, or something like, or who gonna say something. Yeah. Cause that's Devin Haney said something first today. They were staring at each other for a hot minute, and Devin Haney said you lost, and I was like, no, you lost, cause you said you lost, you you fucked up. <laughs> but the first one, I was like, ah, oh, maybe maybe Tank is a little, you know, shook of him a little bit. Man, when that weigh in came, and it was. Tomorrow was the fight, and Tank got in his face like, "Yeah, it's time now." It's and, and you, shit got started getting serious. I was like, "Oh, Tank about to whoop his ass." <laughs> <laughs> nah, I, I mean, I, I knew it just like you said, just, just from the press conference in general. And when the nigga he's, like, don't, he's scared, he's and when, scared. And when the nigga don't give a shit about you, that's when you know a nigga don't give a shit about you. Like he ain't intimidated. When, like you know, mm-hmm. like you said, he was up there blabbing, and talking nonsense, and Tank was just like, "Whatever." And like you said at the press conference, you nigga. Pushing that nigga off the damn yeah, stage. Like, right, like, get get your little here. ass out of here. Like, yeah. come on, bro. Yeah. It's just like said, that's all, all like, intimidating, yeah. right? You know, even one time in the, in the fight, like, Tank flinched at his ass. That nigga was like, oh. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, like, uh, they, they said it. The, yeah, the it commentator like, said it. Yeah, it was, it was like, like, oh, he flinched hard on that shit. Right. That was, that was too hard of a flinch. Like, that was like, yeah, don't hit me, mama type shit. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I was one of those type shit. So, but yeah, like I said, you know, definitely. You know, to see, see what the dude can do, you know what I mean? Come mm-hmm. back from, like I say, he's under Mayweather, so he ain't about to shuffle him. Nah, definitely You know what I'm saying? You know, Mayweather about that money. Right, he ain't about the bread. And, you know, like Especially I said, Tank talking about leaving. So. Right, like I said, that was a good fight for Tank just to get his name up. Because the dude, you know, he had a name, you know what I mean? Undefeated, mm-hmm. you know, he got a belt. He a little catchy, bro, the Yeah, you know, he was like that young Canelo facing Floyd. That's what I compared it to a little bit. Nah, he looked like he looked like a duck. No, I'm just saying, dude, like, far as undefeated, young, you know what I'm <laughs> saying? Like somebody Perry good. the platypus. <laughs> nah, he like a, a nigga from Clinton though, You know what I'm saying right Behind the ears and shit For sure You know he do But Hey man That's what boxing for Man you get timid I'm gonna beat your ass you know, That's what it be <laughs> That's just how it goes <laughs> Right right man, You ain't punking me no more Yo Tank speed is crazy man Now yeah I, I wanna see what What Tank gonna do next That's that's Like we were saying before In previous uh, no, episodes No more like, no names man That's what I'm saying What's next Like No more no names We want What's next who else in your weight class, man? What's next? He got to fight like uh, Haney nah, or Gambosis. Nah, um, not Gambosis. Um, what's the other cat? Tio Fomo. Tio Fomo. He'll fight Tio. Tio Fomo or the other one. What's the other cat? All them names are um, funny. Lomachenko. Lomachenko. That's what I think. He's I gonna think fight he at war right now. Nah, he, mm-hmm. they let him back. Or they let him It was back. it was uh, condolences because I think it was a Ukrainian or Russian boxer yeah. that did die at war recently. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. You know, definitely condolences, you know, condolences to that, that for sure. But uh, yeah, yeah. So I was I think Lomachenko or somebody like that. That's that's nah, definitely that's the fights we want to see, man. Yeah, yeah. Before everybody gets too old and you look like Rocky out there, right, Balboa. The movie Balboa. Right, niggas old as a bitch. 
Out there, but yeah. Kevin Hart and promoters. I'll take that check though if y'all want. Yeah, come on, man. We ain't gonna take a check, man. Y'all wanna see Canelo? <laughs> I ain't gonna see the Y'all wanna check, see Javante Davis fight at 48 years old? Hey, man. <laughs> hey, man. You know Hopkins Jr. out here. So. Hey, man. You get that check. <laughs> Trust me, man. And you gotta think money is different than them castles back in the day. Come on, man. They're gonna take that. Is it, though? I, I mean, Tyson, Tyson bread was different, though. Nah, that's what I'm saying. Like Tyson, Tyson, had, Tyson had that bread. Because Don King and all that, they had that loophole already. Like, nah, we want anything. Tyson made a lot of money off the fight. Want everything. <laughs> we want everything. I don't care. And it's dude. only. It's, I don't care if the fight only thirty eight seconds. I want everything. And the thing is, because we we talk, I don't, I don't know the exact purse, but like mm-hmm. Canelo was getting the thirty million. Right, Tyson. Tank, Tank is getting the like, like maybe 10. like yeah ten. Yeah. Rose maybe, probably hit. Maybe. He probably hit like almost a mil. He got a mil. He at least had to get a mil. He had to. So had maybe to, from the pay per view or something. Yeah, you know, you know what it's what Floyd too. So he, but. He's, I don't know Floyd don't like to pay people That's I why heard, I said man. the mill though That's why I said Tank I don't think no, Tank saying, got 10 though he, he, he don't like to pay no, people No no I'm period. just saying I don't think Tank I don't think Logan got, Paul Got his check yet I don't think Tank got 10 <laughs> I don't think Tank got 10 either That's what I'm saying like them, I bet he got like Them numbers three. be Them numbers be bloated I bet he man. got like 3 I bet Tank got They be making him look better Than what it yeah. is Tank got 3 The cat got He probably got And it. He probably got a mill for going over five. Rounds. And then everybody, like it's something, man. And then for everybody real. underneath probably got like ten grand. Yeah, man, for real. Like, <laughs> it's probably like eighteen fights before that fight. Right. <laughs> got to do what you got to do, man. You want to make your way up? Just don't lose. <laughs> That's all, man. Keep winning. And that ten turn to fifteen. That fifteen turn to thirty. Like oh boy, what's in the Berlanga? He's yeah. still probably getting probably like what twenty grand a fight, probably. Yeah. And Fat Joe got Fat Joe promoting the shit out of him. Yeah, he is. He probably getting a little bit more. He ain't lose yet, right? No, nah, I don't think so. Okay, yeah. Long he did go start going the distance. Like I said, long as, he, long as he don't lose. But most of the people that's on ESPN, yeah, they need 20 stacks. You know what I'm saying? They getting there. Once they start getting belts, it's a little more. You know what I mean? But, yeah, shout out to everybody, man, that's doing their thing. This boxing. We just want y'all to face each other. You know what I'm saying? Except we got Haney coming up this, week, know, this weekend, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, I think he is. George Cambosis. Yeah, yeah he's coming up this weekend. That's now. a that's a really big fight. That's going to set a tone, too, in the, in the division. Right, right. Because okay. Tank. I like, Kane, I like Haney in that one. Cambosis is the out of nowhere champ. Heavy hitter. Right. Haney is the technical. He's been on the rise. He's been wanting this fight forever. Mm-hmm. This is time. This is time, but do he, got, do he got, because people ain't been wanting to fight him just because of the power. They don't think, you know, they, they don't think he he grown up yet. And is he? That's why he ready. That's why, think think, so? that's why I, I think so. That's why I think he, he is, want, too. He want, that's why I think this is a stash I think improved. he going to tag up. I think he, that's why I think he's so, he anxious, like he want to show. That could be a problem, though. No, it could, it could, it could, it could backfire, too. Like get it twisted. Shaky then gonna, in there. Because then you're going to take this veteran light, and mm-hmm. then he's going to punch you in the face over, one time. Right? That overhand right. Blah! Right, right. Hit you in the head one time, you'd be like, ooh. Yeah, that was a little harder than everybody else. Right. Exactly. Exactly. So, we'll see, though. But like I said, I like Haney in that one, though, for sure. Can I get a quick shout-out, though? Real quick, Lil' Cuz. Yeah. Shout-out Lil' Cuz, Gio Gonzalez. Chill. You know what I'm saying? On the 400 meters from Aquinas, 400 meter run, race, whatever you call it. Mm-hmm. But he won sectionals. He won the sectionals, first place in sectionals, 400. I think they came in third place in the 4 by 100. You know what I'm saying? Sure. So shout out to the Rock, shout out to the fans, shout out to Gio. Shout out you know what I'm saying? We watching, we watching. Yo, uh, tell your mama to make it kind of public so people can share it and more people can see it. Right, right. <laughs> fact, fact. Hey, we might have to bring him up here to do a fan spotlight, man. Uh, he's a junior. Saying? He got a whole nother year. Yeah, yeah that's cool. sick. In the fan spotlight that early, fast. man. For that boy fast. Sure, yeah, yeah. Shout out to him, man. I definitely love to see that. Like so, that, that runs in our family, man. That running, that runs in our family. Mm-hmm. So it's good to see him take it. And like I said, Dale, you know what I'm saying, was out there. He just wanted to run with his granddaddy. And now he running past. Oh, yeah. Everybody, you know what I'm saying? So, for real, it starts at home. Shout out to the whole track and field. Track and field went viral over the weekend. You know what I'm saying? Shakari Richardson. You know what I'm saying? I lo- second I, you, place, You know right? what? Came back second place? She, uh, third place, I third think. Third place? She. Okay. Um, but um, it might be second place, though. Um. But I, I was gonna say because I, I I was seeing it all over online. I love the actual. This is a moment in time where there's actual positive false information on somebody uh, <laughs> because all they. I mean, it's not false information because they, they keep saying 
You know, Shakira was just in first first race back. She beat former champs and all that. But they didn't mention that she came in third place. They right, just, right, right. She did pass some champs, but right, 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 the right. champ still whooped their ass in right, that right, race because right. she won and, by a mile. Yeah, she, came, she came in second place. I, saw, I read it. Yeah. Whatever she was yeah, but, you know, it was a great outing. You know what I'm saying? No, uh, it was great to hear about A whole back. bunch of high, high schoolers hit, hit some top five times. It's all the time. It's like, somebody ready for you. It's somebody coming for you. I'm talking about high schoolers running 10 1. It's somebody coming for you, man. That's why you got to stay ready. That's why you can't be out here, you know what I mean, smoking blunts and shit before the race. Because you prep how I talk. You <laughs> prep how I talk, you know what I'm saying? Some before help me. Before the show, we were talking about the you prep boys. Mm-hmm. Um, you prep the, the dude who won smiling across the finish line 10 7. So when I seen this high schooler running a 10 1, I was like, let me see the difference because I, I was saying like wh- whoever in fourth for a fifth Time place, wise, yeah. yeah, whoever in fourth or fifth place, they ran the ten long, seven whatever, yeah. yo. But it'd be long, yeah, boy. That point, I was like, yo, they point fast of, that, out there in Texas. <laughs> that point some, yeah, hey, man, that point some be a difference. You'd be like, oh, you don't be thinking it's that shit. long, but it'd be that long for real. You'd be like, wow, this point seven is this long? Yeah, it's that long. Pause. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> I was waiting for you to finish. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> you had a little roll right there. It's a ni- nine point. I might have to zoom in. <laughs> it's a nine point five pH in this water right here. You know what I'm saying? For sure. I love this with this water, man. Good water. Hydration, man. For sure. Stay My hydrated. boy from college hey. said this water trash. Straight. Hey man. This is this is ninety degrees out in Master New York, man. Nah, Stay definitely, hydrated. Definitely. Sure. Gotta stay hydrated. My boy from college, though, he's because I guess it was a poster that said this is the best water, mm-hmm. and he he he's like a super vegan and all that and like herbalist, I guess now and all that. He yeah. wasn't like that in college, but he changed up. He, hey man, you know, hey, and I was like, so what water I should drink, bro? <laughs> he said tap water. He was like, he was like to be <laughs> real, bro. <laughs> he's like to be real. All water is compromised right now. <laughs> I was like, whoa. <laughs> and he was like, so I just regular spring water, bro. <laughs> like, Same shit, man. <laughs> it is like, I was like, all right. Okay. It is what it is, man. Like you said, man, it's crazy, but hit, hit that button, though. That's all I'm saying. I boom, guess boom, right. Boom, 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 boom. Quick hits, quick hits. Talking about the Lakers, man. They hired Ivan Ham as their new head coach, man, assistant for the. Milwaukee Bucks. I'm about to say where he came from. Yeah, from Milwaukee, man. He been, okay, they got some been, championship pedigree. Yeah, he been he been assistant coach for a long time. He was a hard nose, you know, Draymond Green type of player already. So, you know, Lakers Lakers taking a chance to be honest too as well. But you know, what I mean, it'd be his first head coaching job. So, you know, what I mean, they de- they definitely taking a chance on that one. But I'm taking a lot of chances over there. Right? Yeah, yeah, they're trying to. They trying, man. Like I said, they can't get Russell Westbrook out of there. What is it? That's the one chance they take. <laughs> yeah, they took it last year and didn't work out. But they got another year, and like they're gonna stick with them as the reports coming out. They don't want to give up no extra draft picks or anything to offload them. You know what I'm saying? Because you know, usually when you That's offload, weird them, though. Like, nah, they buddy. must see somebody that like is going to come out in that college year, going to go crazy. No, it ain't, it ain't that. But it's just, that's four years from now. Who yeah, gives a fuck? But they don't. You got Brown for two years, three right, years. You don't like, know how long you're gonna be. That's what I'm saying. And also, <laughs> they don't have no first round draft picks because they trade them all away. That's why they don't want to give up more. So they don't want to pick. So for the see next what happens and try to trade for something back. Yeah, you know. But like I said, Russell been traded the last couple summers for. Like I said, people giving up first round draft picks as the Lakers did to get them as well. But we'll see with the Lakers. But that's definitely a good good pickup. Ham was you know like I said assistant for years. He won a championship last year with the Milwaukee Bucks. You know as an assistant. So. Definitely knowledgeable, so it's definitely a fresh start in LA, man. LA, keeping it in sports, man. You got these cats. You got Aaron Donald and Jalen Brown, man, signing to Donda. Donda Sports. Donda. Donda Sports, man. You know, you got Kanye, you know, following his big brother, you know what I mean? Steps, you know what I mean? Rock Nation, you know what I mean? He took that formula and said, you know what? Why not? Why not get in this field? And like I said, he got big dogs. Those two big dogs. Mm-hmm. Got Aaron Donald and Jalen Brown, you know. Full circle, Super Bowl champ Aaron Donald, and you got Jalen Brown in the NBA. A rising star in the finals, in perfect the finals. time for perfect time to Come announce. Come on, man, it. win a championship, full circle, mm-hmm. brother, full circle, man. So that's that definitely be cool. That's Two championship players. That's what I'm saying. To start your start your league, you know what I mean. Start your um, business. That's definitely what's up. 
And, you know what I mean? Keeping it in the NFL. Let's keep it in the NFL. You got a 23rd, you know what I mean? Civil lawsuit against Deshaun Watson, man. It's like, it's getting uglier for this cat, man, out in these streets, man. Um, You know, it's rumored that he got more, but, you know, they, they're kind of afraid to, to speak out or whatever like that. But, like I said, this is the 23rd that's coming out. Uh, You know, we'll see what the NFL wants to do, man. I, I think the NFL is scared to, you know, to react a certain way because they don't want the, you know, the backlash or anything like that, I don't that know nature. Nothing. But we'll definitely see on that one, man. We'll I don't definitely know nothing. See. I, I, I ain't know nothing from the beginning, so I yeah. still don't know nothing. Yeah, but, it, you know, it's... There's a whole bunch of accusations, but I don't hear a whole bunch Right, of it's been a lot proof. of... It's been a, yeah, it's been a lot of everything, and, and, you know, a lot of people have been saying, like, the NFL, you know, act on other cases without it being, you know what I mean, charged, like Zeke Elliott previously and stuff like that. So they want, you know, a lot of people want to see what the NFL does. So we'll, we'll definitely see. I think it'll come... For the next two weeks, man, and you know, see if Baker going quarterback them or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But that's your quick hits, man. Quick hits, quick hits. It is, boom, boom. It is that 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 fire alarm? They ain't changed the battery. I keep hearing it, thinking it's the camera. Ding, ding. <laughs> I'm being paranoid. Like, yo, is the camera on or off? Like, <laughs> did we just do this for nothing? I, you, I, I had to check the time. <laughs> hey man, I feel you. Better know he's real, man. Better know he's real. Oh man, man I had something I wanted to talk about too. I forgot it. What you got? You got your? You got? You had your thing? Oh yeah, yeah. That's exactly what I was going to talk about. <laughs> man, they had a, I just caught it right quick, man, on Facebook. So I'm gonna go right to it. I think I screenshotted it. Yep. 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 yep players. Yep. Who a couple players you thought was gonna be NBA stars, man? Mm. We well, thought that was guaranteed to be like when they came out of college. You like, ooh, like, that's yeah, he's like, gonna be a prop. That's the next LeBron. That's the, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, like it's it's kind of hard. Like I said, I don't. And, and what, what what what's the criteria? You know what I'm saying? Of, of like maybe maybe there was a star for one year. You know what I'm saying? Do that count or yeah? Like nah, I said, like, like I think so. Like I think like you know going to like the Clippers, like Darius Miles. I thought he was gonna be nice. Him and uh, Quentin Richardson, QU, like shout, shout out, out to, to their podcast, right? Though. Shout out to them hey, boys, the yeah. head, you know what I'm saying? No, no, no disrespect. <laughs> no, it ain't no disrespect. But them boys, how that's how people know them. Like them boys was high flyers. Like they put the Clippers on the map. Like Clippers was before them, and even after them was trash. Like the Clippers wasn't nobody, but they came in there over there, and they was young boys, and they was doing their thing. They got a Jordan deal together. They was doing Jordan commercials, and they kind of like fizzled. Q. They just kept on, you know, it was a solid player, but, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Rich, you know, what you call it then didn't do that great, you know what I'm saying, after Darius Miles. But he, he's one of those people, I think, that came out of high school and it kind of hurt him a little bit, you know what I'm saying? But he saw starting real quick. And then after that, you know, some injuries or whatever hit him. But uh, that, um, like I said, that's all that can come to mind at the moment, but. Jabari Parker. Jabari Parker, that's one. Yeah. He was nasty in college. He was nasty for like a year or two in, in um in Milwaukee. And then after that, it was just I don't know what happened. I what think happened he kept getting hurt. Boy? I think he kept getting he hurt. He came to the and he he talented. Like he still he was yeah. he was on Boston this year. Even Okafor. Remember the Okafor? Not not a Mecca Okafor. Even on him too. You talking about the cat from Duke? The one cat from Duke? Yeah, that had to had to fight outside I think in Boston <laughs> when he was playing with Philly. Yeah, him too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mecca Okafor was different too in college. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then he came to the league and had Bobcats, man. Yeah, he did out. He, at least he had a, at least crazy, he had a, man. you know. Uh, Jordan all right. takes it. You know what? Um, <laughs> the one big cat from um, Georgetown, remember? Um, the one big center, the black dude, center dude. Like he ain't did nothing. He got picked like second overall. Earl Monroe? Nah, he ain't do nothing either, though. He came from Georgetown. I think it was, he looked just like him, though, probably. I think. No, no, so. not, not this dude. This dude was taller. He looked like <laughs> they MB. Both was, uh, this dude uh, was like MB. Greg Monroe? Like <laughs> now, Greg Monroe, like I said, he came from, at least he's still in the league, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, he did all right. He got a check from Detroit. Like, he was all right. But the one cat I'm talking about, like, he didn't do nothing. Like, he was like, he was like, uh, Bow Bow, whatever the cat is now. Like, he's, oh, um, he's a, he came to a bus, too. How came to be? Yeah. Well, that's what you're talking about, right? Is it? Hakeem the beat? It sounds like that. Yeah, yeah. He came from uh, Connecticut, right? Black. Connecticut or, or Georgetown, one of them. 
Black. Black, black. yeah. Charles, like MB. <laughs> Yukon. Yeah, Yukon. Yeah. Yukon. <laughs> do nothing. He can't. He did trash. He was like. He number nine on this list. He did nothing, man. Let me see. You, you know Martell Webster? Nope. I don't know him either, honestly. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Whoever you know. made this list is a fucking basketball fan. Right, yeah, like, yeah, motherfucker. Yeah, they know. God damn. They know. You know Brandon Wright, though? You remember Brandon Wright? Yeah. From right? the Blazers, I think, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. He played for the Heat a couple years, too, right? Yeah, like I said, he, he was not, you know. He wasn't no star, though. He probably got drafted high. That's why they was probably on him, though. I know you do. You remember this one. Well, he to me, honestly, he was kind of a surprise high pick. High pick. Um, Derek Williams. Derek Williams. Yeah. From Arizona, right? Yeah, I think went, so. Yeah, he went to Timberwolves or something. Yep. Like that. Yeah, he was a surprise was, high pick. Yeah, yeah, like he went kind of, kind of high. Yeah, he you know, went like that. Like jump. I said, whoever made this list, they know they yeah, shit. Like he went kind of high. Like he was, he got picked like in second overall. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he went too high. Yeah, that's probably why they thought it was a guarantee. Right, that's what they I'm probably, saying. That's what they probably going by. Yeah, number one, number two pick. By, right, by the picks, high picks. Right, because n- number six is Ben McLemore. Mm-hmm. He ain't like he. He was like he. Kansas. He always had potential. Kansas, he was supposed yeah. to be that. He was he shooting for 40. Out, he came out early, though, too. He was shooting for 40 and all that. He yeah. had that smooth He's shot. Though, league, though. He was playing for Portland last, I believe. Mm-hmm. Uh, this one I was laughing at, though, because it's kind of fucked up. He on TV. Jay Williams. You can, I, I, I can't calm him, though. You can't? can't count count Jay Williams. He played for the Bulls, and he got... Oh, yeah, he biased. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no he, he, he got hurt in a motorcycle accident. No hurt. So he only played like two years for the Bulls. But he was supposed to be a guaranteed star. And then yeah. if you get hurt on the motorcycle for your career. It didn't happen though. Like, career you know injury, <laughs> like Greg Oden. Like, you can put Greg Oden on there. Like, they, just, I think they, nah, they don't. You know what I'm saying? It. Like, number one pick, like Jay Wood got second pick overall. He, number four is Darius Miles, though. Darius Miles, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, number three is who the person who shared this, who I got this from, said Sebastian Telfair. Yeah, because he had the hype. Sebastian had just the hype. That's what I'm saying. That guarantee. He was supposed yeah, to be a guarantee. Yeah, the hype, man. Shout out to him, though, man. No, nah, he, definitely. He, he Shout out to up. all these players. He locked up right now. That's or, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah, 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 he got it. Shout out to him. All right, shout out to him. Uh, Xavier Henry. His name familiar as yeah, fuck. Yeah, it sounds familiar. What yeah. school he went to? Oh, shit, I don't know. It's number oh, two. Oh, saying it? Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> That's what I'm picture? saying. Nah. Okay, I'll look it up there. Number one is kind of weird because he got a... Well, he got a championship, but I understand what they're saying because he was supposed to be way bigger than what he was. Sean Livingston. Yeah. yeah they always talk about his terrible knees yeah, injury. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. But that's that, that's why, I, that's why <laughs> the, listen, anybody with like an injury. He like, still got a chip though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Anybody with an injury, I leave him off the list because the injury. You know what I'm saying? And you got to think, with that injury, he came back and still got a ring, man, and still was, like, playing minutes. So His, his you know name was known. His yeah, name was He had that ugly-ass yeah. mid, mid... Yeah, man. <laughs> you he know, that mid-range, like, 10 feet. Shit, uh, who else? <laughs> right. Felipe Lopez was probably your bus. Felipe. Felipe was probably your bus, man. They call him Spanish Jordan coming out, you know what I mean? St. John's for real, man. He oh, got yeah, he got him. 30 for 30, right? Yeah, he got 30 yeah, for 30, he had 30, man. 30. I think he was nice, but he Yo, they got look. some fire 30 for 30s he, he, coming he, out. He, yeah, I was seeing them, yeah. Who? The I, Ravens? Yeah, I got to get some time to watch them. Yeah, I know they come on, on like Wednesday or Tuesday, like nights, like They got the 2000, the 2000, 2001 Ravens, mm-hmm. or the two, 2002, whichever year it was, that they went crazy on defense. Mm-hmm. Championship year? <sighs> They got that year, 30 for 30. Shannon Sharp was out there filming and everything. You know, oh, good stories coming. Right, good right. stories right, coming. Right. They had they was hyping up the play where Ed Reed, well, I seen it on YouTube, I think, where Ed Reed uh, faked out Peyton Manning. And, like, Peyton Manning was like, yo, that's the best anybody's ever gotten me. Because <laughs> I guess, like, he was running the play a certain way on purpose, so Peyton would see it knowing he about to, he about to watch him on film doing this. Mm-hmm. And then Peyton, like, pump. And then threw it and like picked it off. When he pumped, Ed Reed just turned like around the whole other way, and he already knew where he was right. going. He ran so the route. Like, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ed Reed is a legend. You know, he nah, went from right. the U. That's my squad. Right, right. Shit, half of that team, like you said, Ray Lewis, like Ray Lewis, the yeah, Jew. Bad boys. Yeah, that's definitely a good one yeah, to watch. Mm-hmm. Uh, so it's a few others too that I, I can't I can't think of right like now. I've seen some lot. commercials. Yeah, I'll be, like I said, I'll see some commercials, and I, I just forget because I'm not a big. You know, like TV person. My wife would put on a show or something. And that's some 30 for 30s is so well put nah, together, I though. 30, I want to make some shit like that, man. We got to make a 30 for 30 fan perspective. Sounds good. 
Uh, excuse me. Sorry. We need with some ASMR sometimes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but uh, we need like somebody else with a camera to follow us around. Yeah, we gotta script it up. Do some Kanye shit. Gotta script it up. I ain't gotta script nothing. Just y'all. Script, script. Follow me. Record. Follow, follow me. Watch me make this magic. Follow me. That'd be dope. Somebody told me that a while ago. I just can't pay nobody. <laughs> and my uh, freaking door stopped working. <laughs> life happens, bro. Just Word, man. Life I, happens. Like, I got to get out there to the passenger seat so it stay closed. Boy, the driver's door don't close? Yeah, like, I don't know why. I just got out the gas station and uh-huh. I went to go pull off and it swung open. I'm like, what the hell? And Like, I could get it closed, but uh-huh. once it's open, I got to fuck with it again. You gotta play with it every time. Yep. Yeah. Maybe go to Cheeto or somebody. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta do a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm gonna just take it right to the shop. Like, yeah, yo, just get it done. I need, expe- I need inspection. Yeah, just get it done all one time. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Trust me, life happens, man. Like you said, man. Like I might have to get a new tire too. <laughs> a wheel. A rim. Yeah. yeah. I might have to. I might have to. Rim. I Good. might have to. Uh, yeah, flat your tires. Yeah. Yeah, that's the rim. There. Yeah. You gotta get that. East Main, like a motherfucker. Right, you gotta come up and down this bitch every day. That's a fact. <laughs> Each man to get you. He rides the road, man. New York roads, goddamn it, goddamn. I need to cut a check for that shit. Nah, I already know how. Did I tell you last time? It was on the 85 South Show. I said the, the, the streets, the roads, they, they split into three. So everybody always push it to the next people, like the county, the state, Mary, and the city. Yeah. So they just push it. Nah, we ain't got it. They can do it. Nah, we ain't got it. They can do it. Nah, we ain't got it. They can do it. Go see them. Go see them. Yeah. Yeah. Like, come on, man. Yeah. Get this shit done. Right. And yo, can you do it like when nobody on the road? Come on, man. They never could do it like that. They never could do it. Like, nigga, work at night. I see some people out there, man. They they didn't cut the power to the building when I was in the middle editing a couple times because they was working on the road. Yeah, like I said, they be at night sometimes, but they be at night all the goddamn time. I knew it was dope because it went right at directly at midnight. Like, they had that shit time. Like, then we're going to shut it off at midnight and then we're going to do what we got to do. That's when they need, like I said, that's when they need to do it. They like need said, to do it like that, but they, they, need, to do, they need to do all construction at night. Hell yeah. At night. They and it's it. colder outside, especially during the summer. Right. During the, the winter is a little different. You, like you, know said, what I'm you, can, you can start it, you can start it a little earlier, you know what I'm saying? But Yeah, like probably like six o'clock. Yeah, right? About I say seven just because people get out of work. You know what right. I'm saying? You need that little bit of but yeah, start that shit at like seven, because god damn. Now, I gotta run through it too, trust me. All day that's what I do is drive. Like, you know, like seven to like three in the morning. Yeah, at five, shit, whatever. Yeah, what? twelve hours. Whatever. There you go. <laughs> whatever you gotta do, brother. Boom, boom. We just figured it out, man. Yep. Cut the, cut the check. Actually, right. we don't, don't even cut the check, man. Just fix the roads. Right. That help us, you know. I mean, less money to put in our goddamn vehicles. You know what I'm saying, Yo, man. We did this, man. Episode one twenty eight. One twenty eight. You heard? We on Spotify. We on Anchor. Google Podcasts. We on YouTube. We on. Uh, we on Facebook. Yeah. Fam TV. Fam TV. P- P- H A M T V. You see sports highlights from the high schools. Twitter. You see, okay, you go on Twitter too. Uh, you see, um, post crazy post out that 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 John post. It be on Facebook too. Um, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You might see some freestyles sometimes. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's the epicenter right there. Mm-hmm, you could mm-hmm. like post. Mm-hmm. They be popping on Facebook too. On Fam TV, be popping. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Especially with them high school highlights. Word. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Episode 128. 128, baby. It's your boy Henny Drake. It's John John. And this is the Fan Perspective. And we out. You heard? Hey. I'm back on the yak, you heard? He's on the yizak. <laughs>